University of Miami Hurricanes and their fans are counting down to kick off of the college football season in just a couple weeks, and maybe I'll hear who our quarterback will be. That's right. There's going to be a lot, whole lot of changes for the Canes following a successful first year. Under head coach Mark Rick, CBS 4's Mike Cuno has a look at what Cane fans can Less than three weeks away from the start of the hurricane season, and Miami hasn't named a starting quarterback. There are four viable candidates between Malik Rozier, Evan Sheriffs, Nikosi Perry, and Cade Weldon. But head coach Mark Richt is leaving no stone unturned, looking for the right guy. I'm trying to get him to create habits that will carry him when they're a little nervous or carry him when they're a little bit tired or carry him when they get hit in the mouth and they got to go back and drop back in the pocket again and trust protection and trust the process of how we teach him to read coverage and things like that. Rick said if he had to choose today, it would likely be Rozier or Sheriffs, but true freshman Nikosi Perry is making his case. I mean, Nikosi's a great guy. I know he's had a lot of hype around him. I mean, even I was impressed, and, and I like watching him out there. He's a, he's a great quarterback. You can't be thinking about the pressure. Like, one thing about me, I never think about the pressure. A lot of people assume that I feel pressure and stuff, but... I don't think about that type of stuff. Reminiscent of Miami's glory days, the defense may be the ones relieving the pressure. With eight returning starters, they may be one of the best in the country. I feel as though we're very close. You know, we're at the point of getting over the hump. You know, we're really focused on doing the little things right now. You know, it's a standard. And the more people that keep the standard, then we're going to be right back on top where we're supposed to be. This team may start to look like the old you, but some things should be left in the past. Uh, that was actually pretty bad. Uh, I mean, but he can actually dance, to be honest with you. I don't know what they were trying to do. They said they got to work on it. Him and Chris are going to get it together, so they'll figure some type of dance out when they score. I mean, I don't think we were going to attempt it in the game because, you know, Coach Rick got to get on us, but, you know, in practice, you know, have a little fun, you know, try and enjoy practice and just have a little, little blast. That was star wide out of trying to bust a move there. He racked up nearly a thousand yards as a freshman and now leads a talent to the young group of receivers who will get plenty of chances to work on their celebrations once Rick finally names a starting QB. Their opener is September 2nd against Bethune-Cookman. Mike Cunha, CBS 4 Sports.